Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome to the video. This is going to be a Q&A, as you may have guessed, I asked you guys on my Instagram for some questions and you guys sent me a good few questions. Let me see what we have. I haven't like looked very well at them. I had like one sneaky peek yesterday. Yeah, there's actually a lot of questions here that I don't think I've actually answered before. Like there's a couple of different ones. So yeah, that's exciting. Right, let's get started. So the first question is from my best friend, <laughs> Eva. shout out to you. When will you do a BFF tag and a laughing face? I'll do one whenever you'll do one. I'm waiting years. Next question is a skateboard. Mm. Okay, just a skateboard emoji. Um, okay, next. Are you planning to move out? Um, huh. See, I would love to move out. Only in the last like few months or year um have I really felt like that like I thought I wasn't ready to up until then but I feel like now I'm ready to I just don't really have the money to like I think that's so many people's problem nowadays because the rent is so high and it just seems like such a waste to waste money on rent when you could be putting that towards a mortgage in a few years so of course um I'm planning on moving out eventually, but probably not for like, oh, I don't know. It's really hard to know, like a couple, yeah, I think probably like five years. I don't know, unless I like someone across a fortune. I don't know, we'll see. So yeah, I'm not like, I have no plans to at the moment. Where do you see yourself in the future? I haven't got a bloody clue. I'd love to know. Um, I feel like I see myself working for myself definitely um having my own business or businesses um in fashion and i hopefully see myself as a mom in the like really far future and happy as well i'm excited for like that part of my life if you get me so yeah how long have you been with your boyfriend uh, we got together in January, so eight months, and we were like dating f for like two months before that, I'd say, but flirting for like years before that. <laughs> We've known each other for like ten years. What age is Bonnie? <laughs> That's such a funny um, random question. She is, uh, she's eight. She just turned eight this month. It was a birthday last week, we celebrated it, it was very good. With your clothing brand, are you going to make a shop? Um, yeah, hopefully like an online shop. Probably not a full on shop, like maybe like a pop up kind of shop or something like that, I don't know, but I don't think I'd really have an actual physical shop. But who knows? Are you going to collab with anyone soon? Um, don't have any plans to, but I would like to. I just um, need to get organising if I want to. <laughs> what is your favourite emoji? Let's see what emoji I last used. I'd say it's probably the one that's like, do you know that one? That one. I also like the one with hearts around it at the moment. And love heart eye one. Yeah, I think my favourite at the moment is the like eye one and the thong, the eyes and thong. <laughs> what is your favourite shop in Dundrum? Um, in Dundrum, it's gonna probably have to be pennies. It's like the main one that I go to. Like, Jesus, I haven't actually looked around the shops in Dundrum for so long. I work in Dundrum, but I never like look around. I never spend time there. Except for when I'm in work, because I just like want to get out of there and go home as fast as I can <laughs> when I'm off, so I don't look around the shops and I don't get long breaks either, so I've no reason to look around. Um, 
but yeah, probably Benny's. I do like Zara as well. Um, yeah, I haven't been buying in the shops recently at all. I've been trying to be a bit better with my money, but it's hard. <laughs> I miss doing Penny's hauls so much. I might just have to do one. What is your go-to food on a Friday night? Mm -mm. Well, if you're talking like realistically takeaway, um, I just love my favorite like takeaway is definitely Chinese. I love a spice bag or also love just curry in general. Got chipper the other day for the first time in a long time and I did not feel good the next day at all. So kinda of put me off to be honest. Um yeah. Like if I'm at home I just have pizza or something. I like pizza. Like oven pizza. It's delicious to be honest. And I feel like it's like a tiny bit less guilt. Also love pizza wraps if I'm being really good, but when am I ever? <laughs> um, what is your favourite outfit? I also was asked this, I think, before. Oh yeah, what is your go-to outfit? That's basically the same thing. Um, if I'm like stuck for something to wear, I'll, at the moment, I'll just wear um, probably straight leg or mom jeans with like a t-shirt or a hoodie. Um, and some sort of trainers, probably like bands or something, my favourites, um, or like chunky trainers. Uh, if it's like a chilled, casual thing, which is basically everything for me, unless it's a night out, I'm just wearing leggings and a hoodie, let's be honest. It's like my actual go-to thing to wear. But yeah, <laughs> I just love a tracksuit or leggings so much. You can't go wrong with just... A nice tracksuit like a nice oversized tracksuit and runners this is i think the last question some of them are like repeated they're really similar so i didn't answer every single one but um this one is do you get your brows done in a salon what would be your normal go to be brackets tint or hd um, I don't really like religiously get them done in a salon. I have got HD brows done a few times. I think I've probably got them done like three times in the last five years. Um, uh, but yeah, I just like, they don't, like my eyebrows are not wild at all. They're very tamed. I need to tint them where they won't even exist. So I tint them probably like once a month and I just buy the um I buy I think it's dark brown tint in um boots and then I just like use the tweezers and pluck out like any like stray hairs. I don't really do much with the shape or anything like that, but that's probably because I've had my HD brows done a few times so they're I kinda just know the shape that they're meant to be now and they're like pretty easy to maintain. But yeah, I definitely recommend HD brows though, especially if you like want to get a good shape going. Um, if you just get it done once, you don't need to religiously keep going back. You can definitely look after them yourself. Um, and yeah, I actually the last time I got HD brows, they were slightly different, and they also used a henna tint rather than a normal tint. And I think it definitely did last me like a little bit longer. Than it usually would so if you are going to a salon maybe check that out if it's like similar price you may as well get henna um tint i don't know if everyone does it um but that was about a year ago i think that was the last time i got my brows done and since then i've just been doing them myself that brings us to the end of the q a guys i hope you enjoyed i brought my drink up with me i was going to bring up a cup of tea so we could be all cozy together I'm parched but um yeah I just wanted a nice cool my body my wisdom tooth is growing down on the top here I think because it's really painful um so I just want something cold on it and I'm very tired now so I'm gonna hop into bed I think it's it's 20 to 12 I thought it was like 20 to 11 <sighs> yeah I'm gonna take off my makeup I've had this on for a while now 
I did only put it on to film this video, but then I ended up filming something else and um, then Connor came over and then, yeah. <laughs> so here we are. I'm gonna go take off my makeup now properly. I'm gonna do a good job on it, even though I'm tired, I don't care. I need to, my skin's so bad, I need to um, And I'm gonna hop into bed and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. My next video will be on Saturday. I hope you're liking my new schedule, by the way. Um, so I uploaded on Tuesday, just gone, today, which is Thursday, and then I'll be uploading again on Saturday. So yeah, three times a week now, maybe. Woohoo. So um, comment below if you're enjoying me uploading more frequently, and thank you for watching. Bye.